Right, hello there. Yes, once again, a strange place in Scotland. The old oh. book has the old book has come out there, and today uh, the next chapter really is involving this uh, the tombstone of a George James Ramsay. There's something very strange about this uh, tombstone, but we all tell you that when when we get there. We also uh, we're at Bodden Point, by the way. There's a lovely little area. I've, I found this old map here, Bodden Point. There's something called Elephant Rock, and there's a little cross there. So we're assuming that probably will be the uh, the tombstone. There's also a lime kiln, well that was, the, the lime kiln down there is what you can see. Burp. Oh, excuse me. And, uh, what else was there? Something else there? Uh, elephant Rock. Now, there's an interesting thing about Elephant Rock. Did you know it was actually called the Rock of St. Kirch? No. No, did you not know that, bro? Well, no. now you do. It's called, the, obviously it's called Elephant Rock because you'll, well, you'll see why it's called Elephant Rock when we get there. And the, the lime kiln that is down here, well, I'll tell you a bit about that when we get down there. And up there's the graveyard. That's it, up there. Elephant Rock, as you can see. Wonder why it's called Elephant Rock. Mmm. This is right down underneath it. I wonder what it could be. What do you think? Do you think it could be that tombstone there? This is the one I'm looking for here. And uh, I think that could be the grave there of George James Ramsey. I reckon be. that could be the one there. Or is it the one in the... I don't think it's the one in the, I the railings, in the middle, do you? I think. Or, I think it's that old abandoned one in the middle by the looks of it. So we're heading off to see uh, John, what was his name? Uh, George James Ramsey. If you look closely at the inscription in memory of George James Ramsey, he was uh, born November the 24th, 1852. No, 1859, Nine. beg your pardon. And he died December the 17th, 1840. Oh, how does that happen? Very strange. Now, the, uh, what's, what's supposed to happen here is you're not supposed to touch this. You'll get loads of bad luck. Oh, damn! Oh, God, 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 loads of bad luck now. So there it is. That's unusual uh, grave to this train. Anyway, not really interested in the train. We're interested in the grave here. Uh, a remarkable grave to an unremarkable man. There was nothing remarkable about this man at all. He wasn't famous or anything. It's just that we think it could have well been a mistake they made when they were doing the thing, the uh, the inscriptions, and the family were too poor. To get it changed, or maybe they're just having a laugh to make the grave famous. I, we don't know. Nobody knows. So anyway, there we go. That was uh, the tombstone. We found it, and it was actually where the cross was on Elephant Rock. You can see Elephant Rock I'm way down there now. That's just the back of it. I was going to maybe try and go out there, but it's maybe a bit too dangerous. So that's another one off the list for a strange place in Scotland. We're going to give this one. Oh, I don't know. Six and a half. Six and a half to seven. Six and a half out of ten on the spisometer because. Uh, very interesting, a good bit of history there towards that, and it's a nice little area, a little bit windy, but... And uh, just a little aside here we found from a strange place in Scotland is this old rusty grey room. I think we're going in. It's all full of ivy, so it's quite calm in here. And there's a grave at the very end, we're going to go and see what it's, uh, what it's too. Oh, it's too... Who's it to? Anne Boland, Grey Scott, and Louise Roland, sorry, Roland of Abbeythorn. Hmm, I wonder who they could have been. 1833. 1833. Jesus. I thought we'd find the Holy Grail there from there, damn it. Yes, that'll be one of our 